Anywhere? Okay, so there, there we go. Okay, so uh, let, let me. Uh, okay, so we're going to start at one, two, three. Uh, thank you for coming. Merci pour aujourd'hui. This is so good, I've been a loss for words. Uh, uh, Beautiful day. Thank you for being here. I want to. I want everyone to give themselves a round of applause. Bravo! Bravo. We did a great job. Yeah. Thank you. Now it was the ninety-six. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. We have the right of refusal. Yes, they can pass Bill ninety-six. They can pass Bill one hundred and one. They can pass Bill one hundred and seventy-eight. They can pass Bill forty to eliminate our school boards. Do we accept it? No. no. I didn't hear you. No. no. What? No. no. Do we have the right of refusal? Yes. yes. Why do we oppose Bill 96? Fuck the Congress can't be doing anything. We're going to take it up backwards. Let me ask you a question. If Ottawa had the power to remove Bill 96, should you? Dog language. Yes. <laughs> there we go. Who has the power of this allowance? Yes. This allowance. Yes. This allowance was put in the Constitution, the BNA Act, in 1867, due to the Confederation debates, where our representatives and representatives from French communities in Ontario said, if Canada is created, and we have a provincial government, sorry, we have a provincial government in Ontario and Quebec, which may pass laws against language minorities, we need protection. Justin Trudeau can disallow Bill 96 the moment it is passed. He has one year to do so. So, it, when, when we get a petition going to demand Ottawa to disallow Bill 96, can I count on you? Yes! 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 Where's the paper? Next, okay. It hasn't passed yet, but we do have support in Ottawa to authorize the petition, and it will be done. Uh, my family's been here since 1905. I'm very proud to be a Quebecer. About the people here. Tell me when your family came here to Quebec. <laughs> 1950. Are you a Quebecer? Are you a second or third class Quebecer? Are you anti Quebec? Are you a Quebec basher? No! Do you believe in equal rights? Yes! Do you believe that we should all be treated as citizens of the state who are equal? Deserving of respect. Yeah. So that's why we're here today. We have, we have more than 100 people here. Yeah. Yeah. Right. And the next one we're going to have even more. Yeah. And we're here because we, we care. We have 10,000 souls here. Yeah. <laughs> Is this about English rights? Yes. No. Oh. It's about yeah. the rights of all Quebecers. Oh, yeah. Yes. Bill 96, Bill 101, Bill 178, attack all Quebecers, every one of us, English, French, cultural communities, uh, First Nations, and Inuit. Uh, do we deserve this treatment in Quebec, Canada? No! When you hear the federal government say Bill 96 is acceptable, what do you say? No! no. no. Yes, no. 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 We democracy. Never. Where is our federal backing? And, 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 yeah. so, and, when, and when the conservatives and the NDP support Bill, we barely go and say, we're with you on Bill 96, we're with you on Bill 21. What do you say? That's right. We are all Quebecers. 
You're all I'm Canadian. worthy of respect. Nothing more, nothing more, nothing less. Now, unfortunately, we don't only have language laws, we have Bill 40, which is seeking to eliminate our constitutionally protected school boards. We have nine English school boards in this province, which are protected under the protection of Section 93 of the DNA Act and Section 23 of the Canadian Charter of Rights and Freedoms. Uh, but no one wants to take it away from us. Sir Alexander Galt went to London in 1866 to ensure that we had Section 93 protection for our school boards. And we got it. They're, they're under attack. The Quebec English School Board Association is fighting Bill 40 and worthy of our support. And we must help them. Do we care about our school boards? Yes. Damn right we do. These are constitutional rights at risk. Why? Who keeps stealing these rights? What's, what's with these rights? Do we, do we care about... Put them down. Should, should children be forced to attend French schools against their will? Should the, should the state tell parents whether they're English, French, cultural communities, whatever? that you are going to a French school against your will. No. no. The state has no business there. Right. The choice for all. Human do, rights. Do, do parents know what's best for their children? Yes. 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 Great. Yes. Yes. And, and let, let the English kids go to the French school. Yeah. 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 Anyone wants to go to a Stop school. Stop the segregation of our public school. Yeah. Right. Yeah. All yeah. schools are publicly funded. <coughs> Therefore, they should be publicly accessed by right. a complete That's public. That's our human right. Yeah. Yeah. So, my voice is getting a little hoarse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah exactly. <laughs> but a great job. One more thing. The next time we have a demonstration, can I count on you to be here? Yeah! yeah. We have one more for sure for against 96. Right. Uh, so, uh, Sean, where are you? Right here. What about you?